On June 26, in front of an anxious crowd at the UNL Human Performance Center, the New Orleans Hornets formally introduced their newest additions to the media, Hornets fans and the city of New Orleans. It's a great day for us because we've got two young men to, to add to our program that, that we have a lot of confidence in, that we have uh, a lot of faith in. We are so privileged to have these guys join our program uh, because they are exactly what we have in mind as far as what you have to be on the court as well as off the court. You know, both these young men understand what hard work is all about. And like Jeff said, they understand what winning is all about. The press conference put an end to a long day for the Hornets rookies, a day which began early Friday morning at the New Orleans Arena when the duo got their first glimpse of their new workplace. The Hornets equipment manager, David Jovanovic, briefly gave each player a tour around the back of the arena. Then they relaxed and reflected on the events of the draft and their futures with the NBA and this organization, something they didn't have a chance to do for quite some time. Our attention's been really crazy, and You know, it's, it's one thing to receive attention from UCLA, but it's another to receive attention from the NBA. You know, because NBA is what you work for. It's what you work for your whole life. The next stop for today, the Hornets corporate office, where the new bees met their new Hornets family. Mark, how you doing? good to meet you. Too. Appreciate y'all coming in. Hey, how you doing? Good. Matt Musial, good to yeah. meet you. You too. Good yeah. to meet no, you. Mark, nice hey, to welcome. Hey, welcome. Welcome aboard. Mark, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. See you, guys. you know, I'm from Baton Rouge, so I've been to a couple games, so the arena wasn't that new. But just to meet all the people in the office, you know, that was a you know a good thing to get to meet everybody and do a lot of networking with people. So I'm just happy to be in this position. What's up, young man? All right, good? Yeah. All right, all right. How you doing? I'm good. All right. Good to see you guys, yeah. man. Good to see you. Good to see you. Lunch at Emeralds provided a chance for Darren and Marcus to meet the Hornets basketball staff. The day ended in a location that was very familiar to our new players. Darren and Marcus visited a summer hoops youth basketball clinic where they got a reminder of where their NBA dream began. It will help my girl in the NBA or to get to the NBA was all these camps, you know. You just, my parents just socialized with a lot of camp ball players around the city, and, you know, all you can do is just get better. And then you have guest speakers, NBA guest speakers come in and, and talk to you. It's definitely real inspirational. So for me, Marcus Thornton and Joy Wright to talk to some of these kids, I hope they got a lot out of this camp. You know, um, I know Dan can say the same thing. This, this is the type of moment we dream about, you know, just to have a chance to be able to play in the NBA. And I'm the head coach like Brian Scott who played and know the game, you know, so well and will help us develop well. I'm looking forward to do a lot of big things. I did a lot of big things in my college in UCLA. Um, it's not going to be easy in my first year. It's going to be a lot of trials and tribulations, but I'm looking forward to it. If this is what it's got to take to win a championship for this team, I'm all up for it. Um, whatever the coach has me do, you know, it's, I'm going to give him my best. It's always been doing since I was a little kid, and that's what I'm going to do. So the preparation is always going to be there, and I just want to thank you guys for accepting me to the new family. Thank you.